Happy viewers. Words. So I'm Thoprian. I'm Jepria. Today we're making another recipe, which is basically called chickpea snack. Oh. Yes, chickpea snack because it's really easy to make. As you know, we made a lot of curries, like spices. Ah, uh, it's really like delicious and it's easy to make, guys. So it's mixed it with some coconut, grated coconut flour like that. Not flour, but just grated coconut. We're gonna mix it together and make a delicious snack. But maybe in the future video we're gonna learn how to make coconut and something else or we're gonna make chickpea curry like that another recipe unique Boy, recipe you can also but, eat this recipe for breakfast this is for kids it's very good at snack like that it's very easy and it's mild sweet to make and we're at almost 2,000 subscribers so if you don't subscribe right now in the 10 seconds take your time subscribe right now like this video too because we're close to 2,000 subscribers so do you want to cook Priya yeah let's go She's out for my this ingredient is 300 grams of chickpeas this ingredient is one teaspoon of roasted cardamom powder, which is optional because, Priya, why do you put it? Because it's for the smell and it's good for your health. It's good for your health because it causes like another stuff and beneficial to your stomach by nice smells. It's really delicious too. This is one teaspoon of roasted cumin seeds powder. It's really good for the smell. It's, and it's really also good. good for the smell, as my sister said. Salt with the salt as required. So we broke the coconut into half and then we grated one of the half. We'll show you how to grate it. This is how we're grinding the coconut. Slowly grinding like this and then we go slow to fast. Hold the coconut down while spinning the barrel. This is the grated coconut that we grated from the half coconut that we had before. So we're gonna add the chickpeas into the pot. We're gonna soak it. It's actually a bowl, not a pot, but you're almost correct. Well, we're gonna soak it in some water, about one cup of water. We're gonna soak it in for eight to 12 hours, which basically means when you're going to sleep, leave it overnight till it's for soak. And then when you wake up, it's ready, to, it's ready the chickpeas. So that's how long we have to soak it for. 8 to 12 hours. So sometimes it can soak for 5 hours or 2 hours. After 8 hours, we washed them and took out the old water. Now we're adding 600 milliliters of new water. After we add the water, we're going to boil it as the next step. So the chickpeas are boiling. So you know the white stuff? You need to take them out. So, so far, it's been boiling for five minutes. You have to take the white stuff out because it's not really um, good for you like that. After five minutes, we're gonna add the salt. And then start mixing it. If you cook this, and if you put it in a pressure cooker, it will take about five minutes or to five to 10 minutes. But right now, we're cooking it on the pot, so it could take about 25 minutes totally right now. And also the water has to be dried. So let's take it out. After 25 minutes, the water has been dried. Next, we're gonna crush it. Yeah, we're gonna crush the chickpeas, so let's go into the next step. Now this step is to crush it, so let's start loading the chickpeas into this container and then crush it. So now let's crush it. We crushed the chickpeas. Now we're gonna add the grated coconut. After that, we're gonna add the rest of the ingredients. After adding the grated coconut, start mixing it together. But that's after you add the grated coconut. Yes. Now start to mix it in one direction. Now start mixing it. 
Mix it really good. Mix it in one direction and then mix it in a different direction. Now we're going to add the brown sugar. You have to add it all over. Next, the cardamom powder, roasted cardamom powder. And then after that, the roasted cumin seeds powder. After we added all the ingredients, we're gonna mix it really good. Yes. This is our final turnout. Mix it until all of them come together, the ingredients. All the ingredients, the chickpeas, the cumin powder, the cardamom powder, the coconut, grated coconut, it's all healthy. And yes, because we're all putting this together, it's an easy, healthy snack for kids to eat. Wow, look at a delicious chickpea and coconut snack. Yeah, and this recipe turned out very well. So thank you for watching. If you guys enjoyed, please leave a positive review in the comments and also subscribe and like. Like this video if you found it helpful, found it easy to make and cook. So thanks for watching guys. See, See you in the next, next video. video. Until, Until then, then, bye. bye.